safe, strong, easy to use, and durable defines the Piranha by Sikam, an insulation piercing connector new to FPL. In this video will cover the simple installation steps that make this connector ideal for use in underground applications such as a secondary handhold. As always, complete a thorough hazard assessment before beginning, and for this demonstration, we're simulating de-energized new construction. These connectors simplify the installation by eliminating the need to remove conductor insulation. You don't have to prepare the aluminum conductor with a wire brush or apply inhibitor. There's also no need to cut any part of the connector. The only tool you need for installation or removal is a battery-operated impact driver and the appropriate size socket. Use a 6.3 quarter inch socket when installing the Piranha and an 11 16 socket for removal. Using the proper socket is important to avoid stripping the heads of the plastic bolts. Now let's review the steps for proper installation. Loosen the shear head bolts on the ports to be used. For 4 aught and 1 aught service cables, remove the seal caps, but only remove caps on the ports being used. Cut the cable at a 25 degree angle to ease insertion, but do not remove the insulation. Wipe the conductor clean and apply silicon grease. The grease will also make it easier to insert the cable into the port. Insert the cable into the connector port, and this is important. Make sure the cable contacts the rear window and can be clearly seen. Using a short 6.3 quarter inch socket on a battery operated impact driver, tighten the bolts starting with the one closest to the insertion point and working back. Then repeat the sequence for the other bolts. Tighten all the bolts until they shear off and make sure the seal caps on those ports not being used remain in place. Here's a look inside the Piranha. The bolts penetrate the insulation, making contact with the conductor strands and the Piranha's teeth bear down on the conductor holding it firmly in place. The result, a watertight connection. There is one other installation note you need to know. For smaller conductors, such as number six or number 12 copper, streetlight type conductor, do not remove the rubber seal cap. Instead, puncture the end using an awl. But do not pierce a hole in the seal cap unless you intend to use the port. Join other major utilities across the world and let the strength of the piranha grab hold of your connections. It won't let go.